hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to make this amazing hair butter using only two ingredients i'm going to be incorporating jamaican black castor oil and shea butter i'm also going to be showing you guys how to maximize its benefits and boost hair growth like never before so if you want to grow a healthy and thick hair then i would suggest you should watch this video to the end so you don't miss any useful information so if if you're interested you know what to do grab a seat and let's get into it yeah, 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 yeah. so the first thing I'm going to need is my shea butter so you can purchase your shea butter from your local beauty supply or you can also purchase it from Amazon so I'm going to go ahead and grab myself a bowl then I'm going to go ahead and add my shea butter so the measurement depends on the amount of butter you're trying to make. Shea butter contains essential nutrients such as fatty acid which helps to treat scalp conditions and improve the overall health of your scalp. In return, it will strengthen your hair follicles, reduce hair loss and make your hair grow thicker. The next ingredient I'm going to be adding is Jamaican black castor oil. You guys know that I love Jamaican black castor oil. If you're not a big fan of Jamaican black castor oil you can also use castor oil as well Jamaican black castor oil is known to strengthen each hair strand it promotes hair growth it creates a healthy environment on the scalp which makes the hair grow much faster it's also known to circulate blood flow to the scalp which improve the overall health of your hair in order to maximize the benefit of shea butter and Jamaican black castor oil hair butter I'm going to go ahead and add fresh rosemary leaves so this part is optional you don't have to add it the shea butter and Jamaican black castor oil is powerful enough without adding rosemary but if you do have rosemary you can go ahead and add it and if you don't it's fine you don't have to add it so rosemary is one of the most popular natural ingredient out there if you want to boost hair growth and regrow those bald patches then rosemary is definitely for you you can also use dry rosemary as well but i always suggest fresh rosemary leaves is better because it's infused quicker compared to the dry one so once i'm done adding my fresh rosemary leaves i'm going to go ahead and mix all the ingredients together then i'm going to go ahead and transfer the bowl into the pot of a boiling water please guys do not use microwave to melt your shea butter and jamaican black castor oil okay because you don't want to destroy all the vitamins and the nutrients in the ingredients so always make sure to use the double boiler method instead of microwave i'm going to allow it to sit in the boiling water for about 30 minutes so guys if you guys are still watching this video and yet you haven't subscribed to my channel do consider subscribing to my channel in this channel i do diy videos that can help you to grow your hair using natural ingredients and if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up so after 30 minutes this is how it looks like I'm going to quickly go ahead and strain it out. So remember guys, we added shea butter earlier on. So do not allow it to cool down too long. Otherwise, the oil is going to get really hard and you're going to find it really difficult for you to strain it out. once i'm done this is how it looks like now i'm going to go ahead and cover the bowl i'm going to place it in the freezer we need the oil to be solid before using my electric mixer after 10 minutes this is how it looks like after taking it out from the freezer now I'm going to go ahead and transfer it to a bigger bowl. Then I'm going to use my electric mixer to mix everything together. So guys, if you guys are still watching this video and yet you haven't subscribed to my channel, do consider subscribing to my channel. In this channel, I do DIY videos 
that can help you to grow your hair using natural ingredients and if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up so now is the perfect time to add your essential oil if you're a big fan of essential oil as for me i love essential oil so i'm going to go ahead and add peppermint essential oil and tea tree essential oil so you can add any essential oil of your choice so right now i'm happy with the way the hair butter is looking so what i love about this jamaican black castor oil shea butter and rosemary hair butter is that it will help you to grow your hair really fast it improves the overall health of your hair and it will treat any scalp conditions that you may be facing oh my goodness guys it looks so amazing like the smell it smells amazing it looks amazing it's so creamy and very smooth to touch it will literally disappear into your hair and it will moisturize and soften your hair like no tomorrow now i just went ahead and transfer it to my container once i'm done this is how it looks like now i'm going to show you guys the process of applying it to the hair so make sure when you're applying this jamaican black castor oil shea butter and rosemary hair butter to your hair make sure your hair is clean so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and section the hair into four place so i went ahead and saturate the entire hair with my hair growth spray as you guys can see the hair is very dry then i'm going to go ahead and apply my diy hair growth spray so this is my star anise and peppermint hair growth spray so once i'm done applying my hair growth spray i went ahead and applied my shea butter jamaican black castor oil and rosemary hair butter to that section this hair butter is everything it smells really really good guys it will soften the hair it's very easy to manage and it's going to add shine to your hair and most importantly it's going to moisturize your hair you guys need to definitely try this hair butter honestly guys i don't even know what else to say all you need to do is give it a go and see for yourself after adding my hair butter i lock in moisture by adding my diy hair growth oil so this is my neem and chebe oil if you want to know how i made this hair growth oil i would suggest you should check out my channel i have different hair growth oil you can pick from just pick one or two that you think your hair may love then you can make yourself one this hair butter will help your hair to grow much faster and healthy so if you're suffering from thinning edges bald patches or hair breakage in any particular area i would suggest you should apply this air butter to that particular area then massage it in for about five to ten minutes scalp massage is really beneficial especially if you're trying to promote hair growth so guys always remember to put your hair in a simple protective style this will help with unnecessary breakage and it will also help to seal in moisture that we added earlier on. This is the only way you can prevent your hair from drying out and prevent hair breakage. You can use this hair butter, Jamaican black castor oil and rosemary hair butter on a daily basis. As I said before, it will make your hair soft. It will add shine to your hair and it will moisturize your hair like never before. You can also apply it to your ends of your hair as well. Our ends are the oldest part and it's prone to breakage if you don't apply your leave-in moisturizer to your ends. So guys, I just want to take this moment to say thank you to every single one of you guys for showing me love and support on this channel. I'm going on holiday for two weeks and I'm going to be back next year. So I just want to take this opportunity to wish you guys Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. Hope you guys have a lovely Christmas. I schedule videos already during those two weeks that I'm away. So guys, Please make sure that your notification bells are on so that whenever the video goes live, you will be the first to watch. And as soon as I'm back, I'm going to reply to every single comment. So thank you guys so much for watching. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. And I'll see you guys next year. Thank you guys. 
Bye.